I'm sure you're watching this because you want to seal your basement, you want to finish it, get an extra room, bonus room, so you have to do it. How is it going, you guys? Steven with Break Free Homestead. Today, we're gonna to be finishing these concrete walls, or not finishing, we're gonna be sealing them because we're gonna be finishing this room. We're going with this UGL Dry Lock Extreme. This stuff, need a couple coats of it. Make sure you look, I think it's 75 to 100 square foot per gallon. We have about 120 square foot here. Uh, and we're gonna do two coats. You have to do two coats. Um, we're just gonna be using a brush. We have a masonry brush here. Take a little while, dab it in the little holes. And uh, we're lucky because this is a really nice foundation and there's not a bunch of cracks in it. If you do have some cracks, you're gonna have to patch those. I think UGL does make some products to patch it before you get onto this painting and sealing part. Let's get to it. First thing we're gonna do is sweep the bottom, just so there's not any dust on your workspace, and then we'll get to painting. If this content helped you guys out at all, please drop down below, hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps our channel out, and we'd love to grow with you. Now this stuff is just for walls. If you're looking for foot traffic, I believe they make a separate product, but they do have that. So make sure you get the right one. This stuff will definitely wear if you put it on the floor. All right, so we just got the first coat done on this. Um, about a half a gallon, maybe. Your first coat is definitely gonna take a lot more than your second coat, just because that concrete's soaking it up. And let me show you here. You can see this. So you have all your like pitting or your holes, little pinholes in the concrete. Um, do your best to try to fill them in. It's probably gonna be easier to coat them in on the second coat, but these all need to be filled in to make this whole system work properly. All right guys, getting all messy now. We've got stuff on the floor, which doesn't really matter because we're gonna put new floor down. Um, but we're just shy of 120 square foot with one gallon. Not a huge issue, it doesn't take as much as second coat. So uh, I'm gonna pop the second can, get this stuff done, let this dry for about three hours, and then we'll get the second coat on. All right, this first coat is nice and dry as you can see. Most of this is filled in. You can see. So now we're gonna come back with our second coat. Make sure all these pinholes are filled in. No Let's get it.
All right, guys, we just wrapped it up. We got two nice thick coats on there. This stuff goes quick, like I said, 120 square foot, and the minimum, they say, is 150 for two gallons of these. And uh, we're pretty much shot at the end of that. You know, there is some waste, and there is extra with this paintbrush. But this will just give us just enough to go back and touch up if there's any giant holes that form when the stuff is drying. So 